hello guys welcome to the another video in the python program okay this is like a python automation program like basically we know the strings like in the real life projects most of the times we spend with the logs so we should pass the logs that means we should go through each and every line of the log and we should get the important information or maybe some value or some particular word from the uh, that particular log files okay if you do this manually there will be a lot of manual errors and also it's a lot of time consuming and the manual effort is not a good idea to do this okay so for in these cases we will use python and we'll perform some of the string operations on these particular log files okay so in this video i will discuss how to parse the log files for example we have these sample logs okay from this sample log you as you can see here reverse mapping okay so these kind of things i think we have 85 such instances out of the 85 if you go here there is an ip address associated we wanted to extract this particular ip address string and we wanted to put it in one text file how we can do this that thing we can see in this particular video okay so let's come back here first we will open this particular log file and we will read each line from that log file okay how do we uh, open and read the file okay with open and the file name it is sample logs dot log we don't we want this in the read mode okay because we just wanted to read it as log and we can get this like the lines in that one like log dot read lines okay sorry it is open now what this lines contains is it is like a list in the list the elements are each line so this will be one element in the list this will be another element in the list okay if you want we can just print it and see see it is a list okay each one is one element in the list so let's comment out this point and then we can iterate over the lines for line in lines what we wanted to check is if reverse mapping okay with that particular string in the line if reverse mapping what we want to do, do? so once we found the line which we wanted to check the ip address this line this particular string we are checking if reverse mapping we find that we need to split that string into multiple further sublists so we what we can use here is split by this particular open bracket so with this we will open uh, split it so that it will be split it into two different multiple parts like whatever it is coming this side it will be one part whatever it is coming on this part it will be it from here it will be another part wherever this string matches so let's do that so as we can see here here also we have one more okay from here it will be one part this will be one part again in this once we come here it will be one part okay so let's do that it will be like words let's take from the lines we get the words line dot split by this particular special character okay now let's print what is in the words it is further split into the list the list has multiple elements like this this is one element this is one element zero is element first element and this is the second element so now again further we have to split this how do we split we can say it like ip address equal to words of because this is the zero element this is the first element this is the second element so it is like a words of two okay and dot split by this particular character okay and we can print ip address of zero and let's comment out this particular print statement and we see so now what we are doing we are only splitting this one by this particular closing bracket so if you do this again it is split, split it into multiple lists so now it is split into two types of two elements okay one is the ip address another one is this part so this part we want ip address so that is the zero -th element okay now let's print it and check it yeah see these are all the ip addresses from here okay now we wanted to store all these ip addresses in the one list and we will write them into one output text file so let's take one uh, global list ip addresses as a like one empty list now just append all these ip addresses okay once we append this that means the list is getting filled okay in let's open another file with the write mode and then we will write all these ip addresses into the text file now, with open ip address out dot txt as ip okay now it iterate over the ip addresses list for ip adr in the ip address okay ip ip write dot ip adr and we wanted to also mention the next line okay so that the next ip address will be written in the next address and close this file let's execute this see the ip address out text got created okay this is how it looks like all the ip address 
we have written into one external file okay now let's say for example you wanted to replace this particular dot with dot word so we can perform on this one string operation because this ip address is a string right now you can mention like replace and we can see this so all the dot symbol is replaced with a dot word okay so now we have seen how to pass the log file and how to extract the required information and how we can do the operations on that particular thing so in the further next video i will discuss how to do with the excel sheets for example you wanted to export this data into excel sheet how we can do these things i will discuss in the next video thank you for watching please see the content in our channel if you like the explanation and the content please like and subscribe thank you for watching